Hey, what's going on guys? I'm Bootramp and welcome back to another Boom Beach video. Today, I'm bringing you something special, guys. It's gonna be a collaboration between me and Savage Warrior. Savage Warrior is a Boom Beach YouTuber and it brings out amazing content. Make sure you check out his channel. The link is gonna be down below on the description. And we're gonna be attacking Dr. To Terror today. It's gonna be a challenge. The, the rules is gonna be simple. So we can drop only one boat on stage one Dr. Terror with warriors and as we progress we can drop more boats so when we progress over to stage two we can drop two boats and in stage three you can drop three boats and in stage seven we can drop seven boats and we also are not allowed to boost up our offensive statues that makes it really really hard and this is gonna be super super fun we are also allowed to toss barrage and artillery shell on the defensive structures but we are not allowed to toss barrage and artillery shell on the HQ to assist with damage so the winner is gonna be like this um, the winner the, the, the attacker or any of us me or savage warrior that loses the most warriors is gonna be losing so I need to be very very careful when I attack I cannot just rush in and take down the bases I really really need to plan the attack before I go in because I really do not want to lose warriors I'm thinking like I might be losing like 100 warriors 200 warriors I'm not sure because I'm gonna, I'm gonna be attacking unboosted up and um, it's been a long time now since I've been attacking Dr. Terror without any boost at all and um when i'm attacking dr terror sometimes with boost i lose like 30 warriors 40 warriors but i'm just going in like crazy banana guys like a hard banana so after this video after you've seen this video head over to savage warriors channel and check out how many warriors he lost on his dr terror runs is it 30 is it 40 and you will come back here and tell me who the winner is going to be. I mean, I, I'm, I'm really, really excited. I'm so ready to pump down Dr. Terror. And I'm super ready to wipe on Thursday 6 and 7 because I'm running in unboosted up. So here is my Warriors. I got 8 boats of Warriors. But yeah, I cannot use all, all of, uh, all of the, uh, the boats. I can only use 7 boats because there's only like 7 stages on Dr. Terror. So... Hyping up guys, hyping up. I need to have the focus here right now. I cannot, I cannot be distracted by anything at all. I need to go in guys. Okay, Terror Stage 1, 14 hours left. We have all the time we need today. I mean like, I'm not gonna be using 14 hours to take him down. I really hope it's gonna be like, yeah, 10, 15 minutes, 10 minutes or something like that. All right, so I wanna take out the boom cannon here because uh, if I get shot by the, uh, or, or shoot it or shot by the boom cannon, I'll lose the warrior because the warriors have, have not a lot of HP and I really want to cover them up as good as I can. So one boat guys, only one boat is dropped on the beach and I have those warriors running to the free objects, but I guess like there's nothing that's gonna be harming me right now. I'm so tempted to toss my artillery shells and barrage upon the HQ, but it's not allowed. So there we go. Third stage one just went down. I didn't lose any warriors on this stage right here. We're gonna be progressing over to stage two, where I'm gonna be using two landing crafts to attack third stage two. Okay, let's go. Okay, welcome to my experiment. Whatever, bro, whatever. I'm on a challenge here. Terror stage 2. This is the guy right here. Level 15, Dr. Terror. It shouldn't be that nasty. Sh I shouldn't be losing any warriors here. Even though I'm not boosted up, I think it's gonna be fine. Alrighty, so as you see here, there's like only a, a, a cannon there. And I'm gonna be tossing artillery shells instead of barrage. Because if I toss barrage, I'll, I'll definitely hit the HQ. Alright, dropping those two boats of warriors. And I'm heading straight over to the HQ. And this is definitely going to be a win without me losing any worries at all. Smack that HQ. Come on, warriors. You got the power of the guacamole right there. Do you want muffin, guys? Do you want muffin to get, like, even stronger? Nah, I'm just kidding with you, guys. I'm just kidding with you. Terror Stage 2 is going down, and I haven't lost any warriors yet. This is actually going good. Whew, super hyped, guys. I'm always super hyped when I'm doing challenges like this. I, I really do wonder how Savage Warrior is doing it right now. Is he losing warriors or is he doing it the same, same as me? I mean, like, he also have, like, a maxed up warriors like me. Okay. 
So the planet here right now, it's definitely getting harder. It's like boom mines uh, all over the place. I gotta take care of those boom mines because if I step on those boom mines with my warriors, I'm gonna be losing my warriors like a fish, guys. So I'm gonna be tossing like a true shell on the boom mine and let's see what happens. Okay, we're tossing barrage actually. We're tossing barrage here to uh, take out some structures and some mines and boom mines. And I'll toss an artillery shells on that side, and I really need to take down the uh, the uh, the boom mine on the right side there. I got a lot of uh, gunboat energy, so I'm just using everything I got here. Um, one boom mine right there. I'm not gonna be touching the HQ because I'm gonna be touching touching him with my warriors very very soon. Okay. Uh, three boats guys, turret stage three, and I can drop three boats. I'm going to the right side, I'm going to the right side off the base here. I'm gonna go around guys. Okay, there we go, flaring the warriors right there in the object. And from here we're going straight over to the HQ, and we're gonna be chalking the mortars and the machine gun to prevent damage on the warriors. There we go, three boats of warriors guys, smacking the terror stage three right now. What is he doing? He's actually doing nothing against my warriors, and we actually have a great start right now. I think, like, I do have a feeling I'm on a lead here right now, because I'm maybe Savage Warrior have, has lost, like, some warriors on the boom mines, but I'm guessing, like, yeah, he's very smart, because uh, I've seen his tactics, and I've seen his attacks. He's a very, very good boom beach YouTuber, and attacker, and player, and all that stuff. He's really, really awesome, so it's going to be a, definitely a challenge uh, to, to play against him. Okay, so what's the plan here? I gotta take out the shock launcher here for sure. Mm, I'll toss a barrage on the boom mine so I clear out the boom mines. Just toss it there so I don't hit the, uh, the HQ. Okay, there we go. And I'm gonna be taking down the shock launcher with artillery shells and another artillery shell because we gotta take out the uh, the uh, the uh, shock launcher for sure. Okay, boom mine on the left side. We are going. Hmm. Should I go like to the right or should I go? I'll actually head over to the machine gun. I'll flare myself over to the machine gun, dropping out the warriors. And as you see here, third stage four. So that means I can drop four landing crafts off of warriors. And we're hiding inside the smoke right now upon the machine gun or just beside of the machine gun. And then we're doing the run here and we're not stepping on any boom mines right there. I'm getting burnt. Oh my gosh, of the dangleberry. Come on, come on, come on, guys. Okay, so I, I got a shock like the sniper tower here on the, the, the left side and the rocket launchers on the left side. I just gotta cover up my warriors as good as I can here. And there we go. There's nothing else that's threatening my warriors. Four boats of warriors are just smashing the HQ right now. We are doing great. I so want to toss a tiro shell, but I don't really need it. All right. Terror Stage 4 just went down. I still haven't lost any warriors at all. And I do have unboosted warriors, guys. So this is going very, very great. And I'm very excited to see what the result is going to be. It, am I going to be losing warriors at all? Am I going to be losing 2,000 warriors, 100 warriors? I have no idea because uh, you never know what you're going to be facing on Terror Stage 6 and 7. It's going to be, like, very, very unpredictable. Okay, a lot of boom mines. And I'm thinking, like, I'll drop, like, a, a critter box to step on the boom mines. Rather tossing, like, barrage, because barrage is, uh, it's more expensive. And the chances for the barrages to miss on some boom mines is, uh, it, it, there is chances there. But with critter boxes, you can basically control your critters, actually. You know where it actually lands when they split up. Okay. Drop it on the warriors, and we're on third stage five, so that means I can drop five boats of warriors, putting smoke screen on the start of the beach here, uh, heading over to the sniper tower, and from the sniper tower, we're just gonna be heading over to the flamethrower, covering up the warriors as good as I can here. Look at this, guys. I'm getting burnt, and then we're heading over to the uh, HQ. Awesome. I really hope I won't be losing anything here. I gotta shock the boom cannons and the sniper towers because the sniper towers do medium damage against the warriors. So I gotta toss the shock correctly here. There we go. And that we go. And yes, we're doing awesome right now. We, we are <laughs> we are doing awesome right now. I won't be losing any warriors in Terror Stage 5, hope, hopefully. Come on, bros. Come on, bros. You got this. You got this. Awesome. So I haven't been losing any warriors at all, guys. No warriors lost. I mean, like, this is uh, going very good. I do really wonder how Savage Warrior is doing right now. Has he lost a warrior? Has he lost 2 or 10 or 20? I'm really, really curious, and I really am excited to check out his video. If he, if he was able to even down Dr. Tourist Stage 7 without boosting up the troops. Okay. 
A lot of boom mines and mines. Ter this is terror stage six. Boom cannons right there. Shock launch on the right side. This is gonna be a bit tricky, guys. It's gonna be a bit tricky. Should I go over to the right side here? Yeah, I'll toss a barrage here, or actually, uh, artillery shell instead. I'm tossing artillery shell, and then we are gonna be dropping the warriors on. Ah, uh, it's actually so hard to choose here. Okay. Stage 6, and I can drop like 6 boats of warriors, we are covering the warriors as good as I can here right now, I haven't lost anything here on the drop, we're heading over to the mortar, and putting more smoke screen upon the warriors, there we go, awesome off the fishes, we're gathered up upon the HQ very soon, we are doing the run, we are doing the run, okay, there we go, perfect, perfect, yes, I was so scared there that the uh, warriors would be um, heading out of the smoke, okay, it's time to shock, I got a shot carefully and okay, oh okay, okay, do we got this? Oh man, I I ah oh, the cannon there is taking out my warriors. Come on, come on, take out the uh the HQ right now. Come on, faster, faster, faster. Oh my gosh. Okay, I lost some warriors right there. How many warriors was that? How many warriors did I lose there? Third stage six, guys. I lost several warriors. Um, it might be ten. Okay, twelve warriors, guys. Twelve warriors lost. We are on third stage six, so it's not that bad. I mean, like, it's it's okay. Okay, it's time to rebuild the warriors, and we're gonna be instant finish the warriors, of course. And then we're jumping over to third stage seven. It's gonna be the last stage. Please do not be hard, because sometimes the HQ is very, very far behind there. And it looks like I can chuck the rocket launch on the left and the right and the behind. I might be, hmm. I might be losing several warriors as well, because uh, the HQ is going to be having a lot of HP, it's going to be uh, requiring a lot of smacks actually to take out that HQ. So let's see what happens here, I'm very very excited right now if this is going to be a win or a loss. So, okay, what's the plan here, shock launchers on the right side, okay, I do think I do have a plan, I'll just uh, toss a barrage I guess, or not. I don't really need barrage because there's no boom mines. Or yes, I'll actually toss a barrage to clear the mines and the free object to get back the uh, GBE. So that's fine. Okay, that's fine. And I gotta do a flare upon the flamethrower. Yeah, I'm gonna be gathering up the warriors on the flamethrower. And I'm also gonna be putting smoke screen at the start of the beach. We're dropping out seven boats of uh, warriors. Covering up the warriors as good as I can here. Come on. How oh! Hide, guys. Hide. Oh, nah. I lost a warrior there, guys. I lost a warrior there. That is critical. Okay, we are heading over to the HQ very slowly. I'm trying to be very careful on the movement here. Okay, should I toss a medkit or should I just ignore the medkit and use the shocks instead? I'm definitely going to be shocking the left side and the right side. Those doom cannons can definitely uh, one-shot my troops. Shocking that one. And we're shocking... No, or maybe... No, we're not. I'm, I'm actually going to be waiting. I'm going to be saving my shock in case, just in case guys, yeah, I'll toss this shock right here on the left side, and there we go, perfect, whew, I lost some warriors there guys, so 12 warriors lost on terror stage 6, so let's see how many warriors I lost here, this is terror stage 7, and I lost, how much did I lose? 11 warriors, 12 plus 11, 23, so I lost like 23 warriors only guys, um, I really hope you guys enjoyed this uh, challenge, uh, I'm really not sure if I won, won this uh, challenge or not, make sure you check out uh, Savage Warriors at uh, the tries, and if, we if you won or lost, come back to the channel and comment under uh, beneath my video, because I'm very, very curious guys, anyways, keep on blasting, and have an awesome day, goodbye guys. Boom! <laughs>